and see if that will work. There we go. All right. So what I did, Jess, is just go to our page on our on our actual page. So it should be right there yeah. under the page. Rather than through the event. That yes. is bizarre. It is bizarre. So hopefully it won't be like that later on. So I'm hoping that whoever was on is now on us correctly. And this is Thursday, guys. Thursday the 4th. May the 4th be with you. Um, again, we have our panels still on sale, so our panels are half off. That means every panel in the store, every panel that's online, it is half off. We also have mm, our Lots of Dots fabric. This is 45-inch wide fabric with lots of dots. And it is a Benetex fabric. It is on sale for normal everyday fabric hut price of $9.95. Guess what the price is for you today with these 10 bolts after we do our demonstration on a serger? Because I'm going to explain to you what a serger does and what a serger, how it works and all that good stuff and how it threads. Um, it is on sale for you guys today, two yard minimum. It will be um, a, a $3.98, okay, a yard. But it is a two yard minimum, which makes it. 7.95 or something like that okay so you're just going to tell us after the show when we show this um how much yardage you want if you want many more colors guys there's tons of colors tons of colors and we are also going to give the announcement of the winner of the charm pack challenge that was several weeks ago we had about what eight eight or seven people five five okay five people so we're going. We're, we're telling that up. We we forgot yesterday about it, and we are so sorry. Not yesterday, last week. We are so sorry for that delay. We are going to give a giveaway. So please share. After you share, just tell Jess she's going to be. She's still tallying up. Um, but you will win a fifty dollar gift card. Whoever is the winner, the next challenges that we will do is the price of the gift cards now are twenty five. So if you sign up for any of our challenges, which is the bar. Bargello Challenge is the next one. You come to class, you enjoy your class. We supply you with the machine. And then we take a picture and you will be voted on by our customers and other people. So, hello, Valda. So, guys, what we're doing today is we're going to go into some of the fun um, fundamentals about a serger and what it does. So, first thing, when you go to your serger let's go into let's turn the camera around i'm going to turn my machine on and all that good stuff okay so i'm gonna bounce this back a little bit and what i want to do is introduce you to this wonderful serger we have when you get your serger out the box guys you're going to have your foot pedal okay this is the foot same foot pedal that comes with our um juki saw machines so it is a foot pedal that is a multi-use, so it can be used several ways. But you just simply plug this into the side of the machine. Of course, it comes with a cord. We have a special price on this machine, too. I meant to give you the finance pricing. But we can figure it out in a minute. But you plug your machine in. I'm going to scoot down here for a minute, girlfriend. Mm-hmm. This is the top of the line of our sergers. So it comes, it comes, it wakes up, it wakes up. It's going to tell me when I when I'm using this serger to get to activate it and make it work. You're going to hit your scissors because this machine is equipped with a pair of scissors in the back. So when you're surging off and chaining, the machine no longer you have to bring this around and take your thread and cut it right here or bring it around here. It is like a commercial serger, so you hit this button, and that little mechanism goes there and cuts the chain, so you don't have to chain off all these threads. Isn't that crazy? That is my favorite part. Yep, of this it's machine. cool. And then, what's nice, it does come with a nice tray, okay, for your for your scraps. 
it also comes with your spool caps and your wire and so that when you're threading heavy heavy thread you can use a wire to thread your serger this little tiny foot right here is called the curved foot this foot allows you to do short sharp curves where a lot of machines do not because the foot is too big all right so this foot comes with it it comes with also a door that flops down here and what that does it gives you all your accessories right there at your fingertips like most juki sergers that in that all, all juki sergers that air thread have all your tools right here and it's really cool to have that so that you can grab your tweezers and your needle um, inserter and lint brush and also your screwdriver all right so that is that that's what this is consisted of okay so let's show you another thing that's really cool about this serger this is the first serger in the juki line that is completely fully, fully automatic tension there's no tension knobs on the machine so only thing you have to do ladies is just simply take your machine and i'm gonna move the camera a little bit here and i'm gonna show you these knobs on the side <clears throat> And these knobs on the side is your pat stitch selector, like a sewing machine. When I turn this knob to B, it changes everything here. It tells me exactly what to use for my machine. It tells me my I can control speed, I can control cutting, I can tell it, it will tell me what stitch length to use and and what differential to use. And differential is going to be gathering, stretching of fabric, that kind of stuff. So yeah, if you're sewing different fabric weights, and you know how our fabrics tend to wobble a little bit like this and wave. Yep. Well, this is a, a differential machine, which it actually slows down the feed dog in front or either speeds up the feed dog in, in, in front. So you can gather or you can um, stretch your fabric, depending on the fabric. Especially if you're sewing on a bias, it would eliminate that wave, all right? And the stitch length of control with a stitch length of two and a half, which is our normal stitch length. But on these sergers, the, the MOs, the 2800 and the 3000, it goes beyond the number one stitch length, which if you're using a finer thread, it will allow us to have that finer thread. Isn't that cool? That is. All right? I likey likey, all right? Also, here it changes and tells me what my, my, my settings are. We can also go in here and tell it that we want to program a setting. Or if we want to see more of what how to thread our machine, it tells us exactly how to do it, what needles to use, and all that good stuff. We also have the capability of having an auto cut, which is amazing. If you have a sewing machine at home that cuts the thread at the end of your seam, huh? It cuts the thread at the end of your seam for surging. It's the coolest thing, right? It was something I didn't know I needed in a surgery. All my chickens, right? So then we have what it is. You have a we have an A, B, and a C, and a D. All of this is your automatic tensions. There's no knobs to adjust. There's no book to go to. Right? You could just go to your LCD screen here or LED screen. It tells you everything. It tells you what you're on. All right? So when we want to use our machine as a fourth wrap, which is your basic construction stitch. Now, what I did, Jess, and the ladies at home, is you can always go to Google. is amazing, right? Yes. All right? YouTube is amazing. You can go to their website, their YouTube channel, Juki Sergers. Yeah. And there's 12 chapters and 12 things you can do. But you can download... A easy thing that tells you the five most popular surgery stitches. Straight off the Juki website? Well, this was no. just a Google thing I did. Oh, just a regular mm -hmm. Google? And then it tells you about your fourth wrap. Of course, your book will tell you that too, right? Yep. But I wanted to give you an idea that you can... It. This is great because what it does, it gives you details of what these stitches are made for. Yeah, so, so okay. you should have a better idea of which one you actually want to be hunting for, how to use. Right. But I'm going to make it simple for you today. Do you know what I'm going to do? Mm -hmm. That's your fabulous role with him. Is I'm going to talk, talk to you how to do it, okay? Yep. All right. So and and I'm here to pay attention now that I've finished counting. Fabulous. Hey, Phyllis. So what you're going to do, hey, Karen, is we're going to go to our A category. And we, this is when we're going to use all our needles. 
Now, I'm going to zoom in, ladies, because I want you to understand what a serger does and how it forms your stitch. It is very unique. Um, Juki is a commercial graded product, okay? So they came out with the serger for, for home use. Mm -hmm. So what they did back in the 60s is that, we, you know, we all sewed fabric, was selling fabric with regular straight stitch machines, right? And overcast this machines. But somebody said, well, look, we need something that's going to overlock knit fabric, woven fabric, and give us a professional seam mm -hmm. and also trim our fabric. All right, so I'm going to point out to you here. This is your upper looper. This is your bottom looper. It's hitting down there, right? You have two needles. These are standard sewing machine needles. This needle here is a the right needle. This is your left needle. When you thread your machine with all four threads, it's going to give you that four thread stitch, which you can construct on a knit fabric or a woven fabric. It is a sturdy stitch. It's made for that. So that your four, if you got, if you're sewing home deck or anything, right, you're just going to have your serger set up as a four thread. If you sew something a little bit lighter, maybe you don't need um, um, that additional straight stitch in there. Yes. Then you would convert your machine, either taking the left needle out and having a smaller seam, or you take the right needle out and have the same width of your four thread, right? But not as sturdy. You don't like if you're overcasting. Yeah. You don't have to have it, right? If you are sewing and constructing po both needles, both loopers. So your basic everyday. All setup. all the time, right? And what I love about this serger is that if I want to do construction, maybe then I want to go to a craft. I want to do napkins. I want to do placemats. Well, I can decide how wide my stitch is. Yes. And I can do that by simply taking a needle in and out. That's the stitch width con control. <clears throat> when I rolled him, it's a three thread. It tells you how to set it up. And that is one of the things I like about this machine is that you're not mm -hmm. constantly having to go to the manual. It just right. up and tells you. And what's cool about it as well is that it is fully tensioned. Yes. No tweaking to worry about. Okay. Um, so let me just tell you how this works. I'm going to turn the hand wheel so the guys you can at home can see that this, how a serger actually works. So I'm trying not to talk too loud in the camera, in the phone. But this right here is your upper looper. See how it comes up? It goes over. I'm going to put the foot down. It goes over and it makes a connection with, not really connecting, but over. intertwining with the needles. The bottom looper is doing its job down here. So what they do, they knit. So as I turn the hand wheel towards me, it's knitting. There's a knit stitch. And it comes up and it connects with the needle. Boop. And then the needle goes down. And then the other looper downstairs, or bottom looper, is making another stitch. So that's how it forms your stitches, ladies. And so also in front of the loopers, as you can see, there's a little blade right here. That blade is cutting and neatening your seams at the same time. All right. Now, that blade is also adjustable. So you can go here and make the blade wider or closer to the needle. So it changes the stitch width of how it forms your, your fabric, on your fabric. All right. So that right there is on there. And it also tells you your, your instructions in here, mm. in the part here, okay, how to set the width up so that you don't have to do a lot of guesswork. All right. And then notice that we have scissors here too, see? Yes. Love that. Okay, so that is the simplicity of a serger and how it works. Now, also, we have the capability of changing our fingers. See that little finger moving in the, in the machine? Yeah. Th this is four thread, three thread stitching. Okay. This is rolled down. The old machines, you had to unscrew this, put a plate on. Okay. Or you have to dismantle the machine a little bit. This is just simple popping that up or popping it down, standard stitch. Popping it up is a roll temp. It makes a small, smaller stitch. Yeah. This moves the blade out of the way. So okay. if you don't want to cut, you have that blade moving. The like blade. If you were wanting to do just a cover stitch. Or not cover stitch on this machine because this no. is this is a serger only. There is okay. a cover stitch on. Yeah. But this I, I, brings the blade back up. The blade doesn't come up until you do the first initial stitch. Just like if you were sewing on a sewing machine, when you drop your feed dogs, you have to do one turn first before the feed dogs come back gotcha. up. Okay? So that's how that works. 
Then when you turn over here and you see this, see this little portals? This is my blue, blue upper looper. It looks just like this little mechanism on the side. Okay, so that's my upper looper. This is my lower looper. That's the one down here. When you go up here. I like those little pictures reminding you which one is mm -hmm. which. Mm -hmm. Those are pictures of the same thing, okay? So I'm going to go in here and I'm going to simply back out a little bit so that y'all guys can see. Now, if you have questions or anything, I can, I can help too. This one, I'm going to put my, th I'm going to use white thread on my machine. Okay. I'm going to engage my machine to, to thread for me. I don't want to have to break out a wire. I don't want to have to break out tweezers. I don't want to have to stand on my head. I'm going to show you how easy it is to thread. Having stood on my head, this is yes. a perk you definitely want. Yes, and this is amazing because <laughs> it is a air threader. It's a top of the line machine. And then, and then. It's a quarter yard minimum. Okay, great. Sorry, ladies. All right, so we're going to engage the machine to thread our machine. Yes. I can't remember what I was saying. But you simply go click, and then you turn the hand wheel. And that's until it does its own click. Mm-hmm. Click. All right. Now, this is the top of the line. There's one with all the LED. Yes. Okay. There's a different series that has an LED that's a little bit less expensive, has the same functions, but you have tensions. Then you have a manual machine completely with nothing on it at all, and it is um, um, a, a, a great price, too. We have four top-of-line chargers. Once you give me a calculation for $22.99, um, um, uh, six, six, 60 months, no interest. Now, I'm going to give you a price on this great charger, ladies, because this is awesome. That's the sale price. It's normally 3000 And then you said 60 months? Uh, 60 months, mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, for 60 months, it, this machine is less than $40 a month. Now, let's do 48 months because it's up to the individual. Even still, less than 50, 50 bucks. You can have a brand new surgery, ladies, that threads, threads this up, has automatic tension without having to go over that $6,000 mark, which is a lot of surgeries out there in yes. that price point. This is awesome. It is the coolest thing. And right now, this right here engages the air. That pumps the air through, and I turn it, turn it off when I don't want it, right? So I'm going to grab one of my threads. I don't care which thread I grab. I'm going to grab it. I'll place it in my telescope. Remember, ladies, we got a special deal for you, ladies, after this. I'm just going to bring my thread down to my tension. There's my little thread, guys. There you go. See that, Jeff? Mm -hmm. I do like to clip my thread to have a clean piece. Don't wet it. Put it in the portal. I'll say that, that that is a habit, the good old lick and stick. Yeah, you don't have to lick. <laughs> Polyester thread doesn't have to be uh, wet. You're going to puddle your thread, and then you're going to pump the thread through. And do you see that this is done? Yeah, that is one of the coolest things. We're going to talk about this. I want you to give me a price on these threads here. Okay. Okay, because we, we're, we're going to do a thread special for you ladies today too, okay? You're going to need four threads for your machine, and then you're going to need a thread for your machine. Four threads for your surgery and a thread for your sewing machine. This comes in a five pack. Guys, we're going to have a special deal on these five packs. And we're going to have the colors. We're going to go over those in a minute. But I want you to give me an idea of what the thread. Because you got to grab these guys. This is an oh. awesome deal. Well, I mean, heavens, even full price, this is an awesome deal. Mm -hmm. They right. are $12.40, $13.14 after tax. And that's regular price. We're going to do a 20% discount. But, I mean, at regular price, that's a crazy deal. Mm, yeah, I know. Hello. Five spools of thread. No, five spools of quality thread. Alrighty, And with the 20% off after tax, ten fifty two. Ten fifty two. So, you're looking at $2 and a little bit a spool. And how, And what's the yardage on those? It's a, a, each one is one, a, a 1094 yard, um, 1,094. So, still. Yardage. Mm-hmm. Oh, gosh. That, that's. Go here. There. Clip my thread. Now, I'm going to give you five basic um, techniques with a serger. Because a lot of people say, you know, I, I can't do all my sewing with the serger. Yes, you can. You still need your top stitch machine. But you can do a lot with a serger. Puddle. 
done. You see that, right? Yeah. Okay. Click this down. That is one thing I've seen. You have to remember to click that. It won't. It won't. It so. won't. And it won't turn. Well, that and it won't close. It either. won't close. Your machine won't sew with the door open. The machine won't sew with the foot up. There's no way of jamming your surgeon. Yes, I, I like the safeguards they put into this. We're going to lift our foot, my, my pressure foot up so that my tension door is open. I should have done that earlier, but that's okay. We're going to grab this. We're going to pop this through. I'm going to show you how to thread the needle. Karen's working her butt over there. So there is a little slot. There is a, sorry, my bad. There is a little slot right here. Sorry, my bad. My bad, my bad. There you go. There, and that's a separation guide, just like all machines. And then this little mechanism moves back and forth for right and left needle. So I'm going to right, pop it down, put the thread right here. You pop it, and then you let it go. Now, I have my thread in my way. Sorry, my bad. And this is like your regular machine, just the triangle and pop. Mm-hmm. Well, I pulled it right back out. <laughs> so... You know it works <clears throat> just that I am doing this uh, on a, a, a video, but it brings the loop through. That's it. We're going to go boop over to the left, bring that down. So, 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 so really, realistically speaking, this is the hardest part of threading it. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. If you, yes, it is. If somebody is threading a serger, always the needles tend to, tend to be the hardest thing to thread because you, you have to thread them. But, this but now one, you're not having to go up and around and over here to thread the other two. Right. It all does it for you. My bad. And I'm, you know what? Since I can't see, I'm just going to thread. <laughs> it, does, it, it does work. It's just that I have, I'm just in a weird spot. You know, with the camera and stuff, okay? Mm -hmm. All right. But it do, this does, though, also, if you want to, you can do it the other way. Yes. Now, you know what's nice about this machine? The lighting can be warm, or it could be LED. You can change the lighting depending on where you are in your house and what you're sewing on. Now, that I didn't know. Yeah, it has a way of dimming and changing actual hues of the light. Isn't that crazy? But that's cool, though. Yes, it's, 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 it gives you a lot of machine functions. All right. So once we are finished threading, close your door. Put your little trash can on. Put your little trash can on. There you go. Put your foot down, and then you stitch a little bit. Have just to, to catch everyone mm -hmm, together. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So we're just going to grab some fabric, okay? <coughs> I'm going to grab a color so you can see. God bless you. I'm going to grab you. a color so that you can see. And, before, and what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a stitch, ladies and guys. So here's just regular cotton fabric, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to just take this, start surging, and I do a little trimming. And what's nice is that this machine does not zoom, because you, you have com complete speed control. Yes. With this, like a slot bar, like you have on a sewing machine. And your foot control is very, very touch friendly. Like my household furry little friends that want to walk by and sit. I'm going to hit. That's the That's bottom. That's my favorite part. That's the that bottom. That is my favorite part. Now, favorite. this is your four thread stitch. So, this is the stitch you're going to use and construct all your knitted garments and all your woven garments. Okay? This stitch, I'm going to show you right now and see how the tension is perfectly balance there's no tweaking ladies okay you have a perfect stitch okay now let's poke poke you around back at me all right i look everybody teased me about the, these darn shower curtains <laughs> hello sundress sundress and shower curtain so jess is going to share share with you this shower curtain pattern so you can have this pattern for free it is a qt tread qt what qt uh, fabrics fabrics this was done with a um, charm pack. No. A layer cake. La my bad. Layer cake. I did use Stonehenge. I love Stonehenge, right? No, that's canvas on the side. Canvas? But that's not Stone... Oh, no, it's canvas. Yeah, okay. Right. No, It's Northcott. still made by Northcott. Northcott. Yeah, yes. yeah. That's my bad. So, look. I constructed this whole, whole 
shower curtain completely with my serger. So I'm gonna point out to you right now how cool this is, okay? So hold that for me, girlfriend, and I'm gonna zoom in. Okay, so everything is done. Now I decided since I was surging this and it wasn't gonna be a stress point, this is using just three thread, but using a three thread wide. So this stitch is not have, it doesn't have the safety stitch. This is your safety stitch right here. See, the safety stitch is the stitch within your serger. Yeah. I prefer using the safety stitch, but I said, you know what? I don't need it for this. It's just going to be quilted. So I surged a three thread wide and I just took my fabrics and surged the pieces together and I quilted it, right? I just surged them like a quilt block. Right. So this could have been a quilt top. Yes. Right. Everything is constructed with the serger itself. So I did not have to go to my sewing machine until I top stitched the edging. So all of the seams with the side seams are all done with my serger. As you can see, it's wonderfully constructed. Everything inside. I, what's nice about a serger stitch when you're using a four thread and a three thread wide is a quarter inch seam allowance. Yes. So the only thing I did was I just simply surged my raw edge, went to my sewing machine, pressed it, went to my sewing machine, and I top stitched it mm -hmm. with my sewing machine. And that was the only thing we did with the machine. Was I only that top stitch. Yeah, and I did the same thing here. I surged it, the, the, and turned it under, and top stitch, top stitch my 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 backing, see my my bottom, and then the top part is is done the same exact way. I did put some interfacing in here so that's gonna so, so the, when the I, when intention I, when we get to putting the, the buttonholes i can in. do buttonholes i can do those large grommets yeah so, so i i did some stabilizing so that i can do whatever i want i can do a buttonhole and i prefer using a keyhole when i do this but if i want to do do the the grommets it's sturdy enough for i can do the grommets but isn't this the coolest thing so guys if you and you had this done in uh, an hour or two it yeah, wasn't yeah long. all this right here was stitched it was it's a 72 by 72 shower curtain you know i know that by heart now <laughs> all right but i can't remember how many it should tell you how many um, oh let's just see because i know we used like half of two different yeah ones. i did i got i did my batik and i did my cotton some people don't like to mix their batiks and cottons but hey i like to mix my batiks and my cotton range the 10 inch squares in seven by seven so 49 so 49. just a smidge over a full layer cake so i did i bought two layer cakes and i did whatever how many blocks they told yeah. me yeah so i mixed and matched it all right i was going to tell you something i can't remember oh think of this ladies all right see this four patch right here wouldn't that be great for a pullout that would be. Mm-hmm. So you can do layer cake, layer cake, layer cake, layer cake. There's your pillow thought. All right. You put some piping around there and there you go. Right. But this is, this was so cool doing this. Okay. And I just randomly picked my fabrics and just sew them the way I wanted to. Just like I would do with quilting. But isn't that an awesome deal? So that was real fun. And you know what? Layer cake is very, very inexpensive. Yeah. Oh, you can no. do this on you can do this on all layer cake. You can just get one layer cake and do it too. Yeah. And it's not to say you couldn't do it with charm packs too. It would just take a few more It'll pieces. It'll take a little longer to do. You can also do, this would be fun. You can also do a jelly roll. Strips. Yeah. Well, I'm over here thinking some of those charm packs, if you had some solids, this would be a fun one to make like a rainbow towards Pride Month. Hello. Right? So there you go on that. See, I'm going to go right to, to, to the machine so that you can see this. So, guys, that's how easy it is to do. So, the only thing you would do is just take any fabric that you want, okay, with the serger, and you're going to sew. So, let's do a knit seam, okay? Because knits can be a little... And we have done nothing to this machine since we left that cotton No, spot. I'm not doing any adjustments. But see how, it, see how it's doing that little pushy-pushy? Okay. Yep. Well, all serger's pushy-pushy. Yes. Well, you have a floating feature on the machine, so it will, when you're doing this, you can actually allow it to float. There's a float function here. So what it does, it keeps it pushy-pushy from happening. Okay. All right? It's a float feature. Also, too, when sewing knits, okay, you're going to find that it's going to wave a little bit. Uh-huh. That's when you would use your differential to make the machine sew the fabric flat. Okay. Also, and that's something you would learn in class. Yep, you learn in class. Also, just find out how to price. I'm going to give y'all 
discounts on all of these wonder clips okay wonder clips are a must for a serger and a must for a sewer we're going to give you a, a special price on the fray block we did receive some more in here lady that goes out quickly all right so full price these wonder clips these large ones here are going to be 5 30 and once we get the sale on them they are going to be 424 yeah you know wonder clips can be expensive they can be if I, you let them yeah i love this no i love this um jess because i like the bigger mouth so it fits my binding better I when haven't I, really used the large I, ones. I've when, always been a fan of the little ones. Well, these are nice because it, your 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 binding fits right in that mouth. Okay. So it really does do a, a wonderful job. If anybody wants any of these, we can take care of you on that. But I'm going to want to clip, ladies, okay? So when you want to clip, it's just easier to just have all the stuff right in place. So do that. And it keeps you from hitting a pin. Yes. And this is what makes it handy in quilting, too, is that... Your seams are not shifting and moveling as you're sewing. See, I'll take that, take that one to clip out. What was that? Woobling. Woobling. Oh, my chickens. Now, the first thing I wanted to do was grab my scissors because that's a Force habit. Force of habit, yes. But the bomb is that, okay? <laughs> so there is your fabulous flat overlock stitch for your knitted garments this is just a nice interlocking fabric and i would normally use in my needle my left needle i would normally use purple thread okay as you can see i can pull really hard to see white yeah all right but that would be purple instead okay now you're going to also want to do cuffs yes so i'm gonna do a little neckline like a little i'm gonna do a little mock neckline ladies okay so think of this as my neckline that will go on my 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 kid or either over my neck mm -hmm. okay this is her interlock here is your your cuff material your ribbons and and, and things you go around your neck and this is cut and this is your uh, it stretches okay so you're stretch this to your neckline you would normally have this cut and then pin or wonder clip so that you have four yes points left north south east and west and then that will give you the proper stretch and and, and, and and easing of this fabric so you can place the fabric underneath the foot and normally on a knitted pattern it is a quarter inch seam allowance so you won't trim anything okay so you trim it to, when you cut your, your pattern out with your rotary cutter, it's going to be quarter inch seam allowance. And you don't have to do any 5 8 So you're going to stretch your top fabric together with this one. I'm going to trim a little bit because that's way, you know, because I'm on an angle, guys. And you're matching your, your three sides, three pieces together. And I'm easing this fabric with my finger, as you can see. See yes. that? All right. When you come to my surgery class, you will actually do samples like this okay. to take home with you. And then, voila, here is your inside seam, right? And then this is your fabulous outside seam. And there's no pookers. Oh. There's no little, oh, I gotta go home and press that, right? It's all done. Isn't that nice? That is nice. Okay. Now, let's say. You're making me think I really want to take that surgery class. Mm, yeah, and, and, and you know what? I'll supply you with a Zoom. Okay, getting, I'm kidding. So now the problem is that won't help me with my grumpy. Right, I'm, I'm got you. You bring bring your 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 grumpy. Um, um, this is let's just think. This is going to be the top of your pants. Okay, you hear me? Mm-hmm. Okay, so we want to sew sew elastic on. Okay. Just like you do with your inside circle, you're going to do the north south north okay. south east and west. So you'll have these and this will be sewn together in a, in a circle. Right, mm -hmm. and then you would square up. You put a pin here or one to clip, and then you would do the same thing with here. Right. Okay. And you put it in your circle. Do the same thing. This time, I'm just going to print right, wrong sides up. Okay. I'm gonna start surging. And normally, you would have this. You would, you could put the blade down so you don't slice your elastic. Yes. I'm going 
because when you when you get into knowing your serger, it is going to be two of the coolest things so that you don't have to do that because you'll be able to edge and see where your knife is and you will use that as your guide. But you'll start surging. And you're going to slightly stretch your elastic to the, 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 the mark. And you're placing this in here. And I know I'm talking a little bit, a lot. So all I'm going to do is just show you some more. We're ready, we're ready to do some fabrics, right guys? Mm-hmm. But you're going to stretch this to well, yeah, that's right and then that is your surging of your elastic right and that's how it looks and what you do is you're going to it's take like this it's getting caught, but it's not. you're going to take this you're going to pin it and you're going to stretch it and sew with your machine all the way down you can do uh, a couple rows you can do one row you could it's like make a little casing okay and sewing it down and that is all you need to do isn't that wonderful that is okay now let's show you how to gather with the serger and a serger guys is wonderful for gathering because what you're doing is you're able to sew the overlock stitch right and you'll be able to neaten your edge, neaten your edge and gather. So this th th this time, I'm going to show you how to do this. Still your four thread stitch, but you're gonna come over here to your stitch length and you're gonna make your stitch length a four. That's like really stretching your, your stitch out, like a long stitch. You're gonna take your gather, your differential feed. Right now it's on end, so I'm gonna surge a little bit and I'll show you what, how this works. So right now I'm doing a flat stitch, right? So right. if I take this to one point or somewhere in between one point five, one, five and then it's going to start doing a little pooker here. If I go move this, the more I move this to two, the more it gathers. <clears throat> and if you want more, more gather than that, ladies, you're going to, I'm taking my back, you're going to I'll take your gathering foot. There's a gathering foot that actually gathers more. Take it out to the back. Let the machine cut the thread. And there is a gather. Isn't that wonderful? That is cool. <clears throat> if you need more gathers, guys, you can come in here and grab one of the straight stitches inside your, your serger stitch. Or you can buy the gathering foot, which does uh, even more gathers. So that's what it's made for. But you grab one of these straight stitches, like you would do on a sewing machine. And I'm trying to get my finger here. And you can pull and gather more. I do not have the clear foot on. I'm using my standard foot. And everything stays intact, but you can put the gathers where you want. You won't find yourself breaking a thread. Okay? And that is how nice it is to do gathering with your machine. If you're doing your thin elastic such as, such as this, this is a quarter inch for bathing suit, there is a guide inside the foot here. Okay. That you can slide the, the, the elastic in. I'm going to snap my foot off. I'll show you. You slide it in here. Uh, Phyllis, no, we don't have the clear foot on today. We've just got the regular yeah, foot. Yeah, we told us. No, wasn't okay. paying attention. That's okay, girlfriend. You were doing. I've been fighting the stapler. Yep. So this foot allows you to take and sew twill tape. That is really cool. Ribbon when you want to stabilize the seam or elastic, and you can pull this and sew at the same time. So that's made especially for your quarter inch seam, quarter inch elastics, okay? It is also a, see that screw right here? Yes. That screw allows us to adjust to so a bigger to elastic. Isn't that too cool? That is. Right? I think that's the bomb. 
All right. And the foot goes back on. You guys, I think we're going to end that right there with that surgery stuff. So what do you think about that? Isn't that cool? That was cool. There were a lot of things I didn't know about that we did today. And yes. There is amazing what a surgery can do. It changes your whole, um, it's like having something in, in any kind of room that you're crafting or, or wood making or cooking. If you have the right tool, you have the right performance. And then, did you check this out? And people that's actually afraid of surgeries, um, they don't have to be. And then, look at that. That's your pins right there. Okay. All right. So, guys, guess what? Drum roll for the person who won the charm pack challenge. Who was that girlfriend? It's going to be quilt number one. Quilt number one. So, guys, whoever has quilt number one, please put in there. They, they're the winners. Quilt was, number one. This one here, it was one of the two blue and yellow ones. Yes, so I can't remember her name right now at the moment. Um, but. All right, so. Um, make sure that you. NFL is going to be up front. And let us know. We'll give you the gift card. No, the rest of them are going to be to the right of the silk rack. So sorry. Um, so, so wonderful. $50 gift card, Fabric Hut. You can use it for anything. Yes. Right? So, guys. Volda, uh, with not using it, you're going to have to do like me and uh, definitely consider sitting in on this surgery class because uh, I'm over here watching him go and I'm like, I need this. <laughs> um, This right here is the fray block. This doesn't harden, ladies. So, this is what you want to use on a dead end seam, okay? That's nice to do. All right. All right, and we got the price on that. Full price, it's nine twenty-one, with today's extra special discount, seven thirty-seven. Yes. Now, what we're gonna do now, girlfriend, is I want y'all to see these wonderful threads, okay? Before we go into our fabric sale, all right? But these, this is all black. It's five blacks, guys. Five black threads. Remember, four of these gonna go on your surgery. One is gonna go on your sewing machine, or you can use this strictly as a sewing machine thread, or your long arm or quilting or anything. It is a 40 weight thread, polyester, so it won't bleed or stretch or fuzz. We have black. We have this wonderful charcoal. All right, lots of thread, ladies. Of course, you know we have white. So you just tell her, we can put it in your bag. We can put it right in your order. We have this lilac on my chickens, right? Mm -hmm. We never put this thread on sale unless you watch us live. We have, oof, look at that. That beautiful royal purple. That is a gorgeous purple. If y'all guys are in town, you want to come and you want to test the serger out. Now, Cindy, this is not just for your serger. You can use this on any of your machines. Yes, yeah, yeah. tell us, long arming. I did it on a long arm. It is cool. Hey, Ed, Addy, how you doing? Here's your fabulous pink. Remember, four threads are going to go on your serger. Or three, right? And one in your sewing machine. How much is the price of this again? Ah, uh, that I don't remember. You told, it's like not. It's like less than nine dollars, I think, with tax. Uh, uh, without tax. But oh my! Uh, chicken. No, it was ten fifty two with tax. So that's ten with the sale. Fifty two. Uh, over. This is a lot. Think of this. Eleven hundred yards per spool. So almost more for Oracle spool. Mm hmm And then we have this wonderful blue. Twelve. Twelve forty is a great price, and we have this great price. This is great for quilters because it's got that a nice color. Yes. Can be blended, and that is our colors of the week. But we just got some of this in here, and, and one of the white is going away. Yep. All right. But guys, you know, to get a, a quality thread like this is hard to get a quality thread at this reasonable price, and it's wonderful, by the way. Some of you might know this, who embroider and who quilt. Wonderful is a thread maker. They make wonderful threads, so they have these wonderful colors that you can do. All right, so guys, I am so excited right now. I can't wait to get into this nitty-gritty stuff over here. We're going to say bye to this wonderful serger. Yep. Remember, you can get this thing for less than, what, 50 bucks for 48 months and less than... 30 bucks, right? Or, for, yeah, for the 60 months. Oh, my chickens, you know? You can get a top-of-line serger, and it's easy to use. 
Yes. Amazing. And if you buy it from us, it comes with free lessons. Right. Now, if guys, I'm thinking about doing a Saturday, come try a, a, a serger. If you are interested, the price of this serger, the price of this serger is the normally $29. Price, it was $22.99 yeah, was normally, the sale price? Normally, normally $3,000. It's on sale for $22.99. Half the cost of other air threaders out there with the function. No air threader has this fabulous feature here. That is, it, the moment you showed me that, that became my favorite thing. You had me at, what was that, what was that movie? You had me at? Hello. Hello. Yes. Well, you had me at cut. <laughs> is that the same price cash versus uh, it's a, financing? Yeah, it's, a, it's a sell price. Uh, so it's, that, that, no, that it's is. No, it's no, it's no. For instance, there's no other discounts. It is the price. That's the lowest price we can, that we can ever sell the surgery. All right, so twenty two ninety nine is just the straight price. I love the screen, Addy. The screen is amazing. It is everything is auto, and we will ship it to you. Now we do have to pay shipping to ship it. Yes. All right. So, so, but you know what, ladies? If you guys, since you know me, you can call me. What's the number, girlfriend? Uh, 757-588-1300. I will do something. Just, hey, look. Just ask for Avery. <laughs> ask for I'll, look, I'll wiggle, wiggle, something, something. Okay, girlfriends? I can't do it. You know, I cannot say anything on online. No, yep. Because, you know, it is um, against the policy of all sewing machine manufacturers i can only tell you what it is to sell okay but don't forget this wonderful surgery and you know what i love that cindy um call me girlfriend I'll get you a good price on them <laughs> i got them in stock are we ready i'm We're... ready when you are ready don't forget this wonderful three um so is no one up front no uh i don't know where anybody's at all right there's somebody coming, ma'am. Okay. Oh, what Nisi just went. Okay. Just want to make sure. Guys, I'm okay. so sorry. All righty. So we're pardon our dust. We're making room. Now, can you link this guys i'm showing 10 of the most popular fabrics that we that i found in the back room on my chickens right and, and I, I have stolen one of these before to put out here on the floor and this is micro this is called uh lots, lots of, dots. of dots so we just link the lots of dots right that's up yeah two it's yard minimum guys okay so this is a benetech fabric now oh i didn't give you this one chicky poo this is called violet white Okay. It is high quality. Look at that, isn't it right? L listen it, to this. It, it's crazy. Some of these. We're gonna we're gonna give a little special deal with those ladies that are inquiring about the surgers today. Okay. Yeah, Do Bo boss man is here. <laughs> All right. What I'm what I'm what I'm giving you guys the opportunity right now is that it is a two yard minimum, so it winds up being seven ninety eight for the two yards. Okay, we did a little video last night. If you don't see the color you want here, Just it's ask. still it's still a two yard minimum. You go online, there is mm -hmm. a link, and you can purchase this online. It is crazy how much fabric we have, how many choices. But this, guys, is gorgeous. If you want us to cut it, we can cut it right now. But that's called violet. Violet white. Okay. Mm -hmm. Alrighty. That one, I don't know, so gracious. Let me look through the stickers here. The dots on that's a little smaller, though. Yeah, these yeah, are, these are micro dots. Uh, the first dots, how big were the first dots? Okay, let's get a little ruler. Um, by the way, this is, it is a 45 inch. All right, right the regular a, dots a, are eighth a, of an inch. What, what volume? Oh. Here, here, I'm getting the ruler. But it's an eighth of an inch dot. Oh, it's a probably how wide the width of the fabric. It's yeah. forty-five mm -hmm. inch mm -hmm. wide fabric. Yes, yeah, forty-five inches just on a roll. Addie is new. Addie is my friend from that I've known from Richmond. 
we we know we go we go back a little bit. Hey, Addy. All right. Hey, Aretha. Everybody, if I hadn't said hi, hi. Hi. <laughs> Doug said hi. Hello. Karen said hello. Oh. All right. So these guys, these ten boats that we're cutting, we can cut this. These are warehouse fabrics, ladies. When you come into the store, you cannot find these fabrics. So if you want some, these are great prices. Unbelievable. I don't know how long we're going to sell them at this price. But, guys, this is normally $9.95, everyday low price. And we have marked it, Kathy said hi. We have marked them down to three ninety eight. When it comes down to the nitty gritty, three ninety eight. But you buy, got to buy the two yard minimum. Any yardage from beyond the two yards is three ninety eight a yard. Isn't that the coolest darn thing? That is that. All my check ins. And guys, I tried to hide these babies, but you just won't give up. Look, 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 ladies. I don't know if you know this, but I go in the back. The colors of the ones on this is a uh, sea foam. See how. It is a uh, pretty. I'm looking through the tags now. It is the prettiest blue. It's not really a sea foam. It's like a turquoise, but it's like faded turquoise. You see that, right, guys? Isn't that awesome? I've got nine tags here, so there's one I'm missing. I think that might be this one. That's the light green, white. Yeah, they call it light green, but it is. You see how that is a blue, right? Oh, I got your bright color, Cindy. Look, we can put that right into the surge box too. Hello. All right, anyone wants these? This is that lilac. Uh, all right, so that one was the violet white, and the one on the left is the light green white. Yeah. You, can, you can help her, sir. Okay, so this, you know what I call this? I love this because it's like a sea, I call it like a sea foam, okay? Because it is that wonderful light, something that you would see at a beach. Curtains would be fabulous with these. Would be nice mm -hmm. because it is such a faint dot. Yeah, just that smidge of color. Mm -hmm. Love it. Now, guys, we're going to go into our. Here you go, sweetie. <laughs> oh my chickens! Look at this. Oh, ooh, 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 ooh. look at that. Mmm. It's going to be just a medium pink. And medium white. pink and white dots. And guys, you know what's wonderful about this? Again, this could be for quilting, backing, anything sashing all that and garments because you you get in a nice quality right so normally people go into um uh, our 100 percent cotton area for garment construction like the bridal that the um heirloom and the poplin and what else yeah. is over there doug the batiste right, the yes. the batiste. this is what you would see in one of those trendy you know southern yeah christine gown yeah. fabrics <laughs> and all those great products you know, these colors can also be for boys, too. You know what I mean? Absolutely. For shorts and things. So that is that is a wonderful color of that. Take a look at this orange. Oh, my. This orange is gorgeous. Which is light orange and white. It says light orange. But you know what I like, what I'm going to call this? This is a nice bright orange. This, this is, is, this is, Cindy, this is you. But this is like a tangerine. Yeah, it almost a primary orange. Mm. Nice and see the dots on this is a little bit bigger. So guys if you like I said if you don't see what you want There is what 30 more bolts, right? Yeah, probably 30 more probably more a lot more and this is something we're going to run through definitely for a Mother's Day Okay And when you come back at our happy hour, you know open a ball one because <laughs> I have some amazing blending blenders that we're going to do mm -hmm. buy one get one free i'm not going to tell you what it is though the orange and the bright green okay when we get to the bright green oh my chicken look at I that i think that's the one color i don't have the name on is that bright green <laughs> we're going to call it lime with white dots okay take a look at this one mm -hmm. this is pretty because it is that light is pink Cindy. light pink and that is white pink it's called white and pink, okay? That is the one with the white background and pink dots. And I'm just kind of giving you this up close so that you can see how wonderful. Again, this is a really good quality. Isn't that pretty? Mm. Pretty, pretty. And this one here, girlfriend, what is this one? That one is the dark pink white. Okay, so I'm going to put, look, I'm going to put these in here in a row. So that you can see. You know I have the guys I'm what I was trying I got I got sidetracked. I had I get I go in the back 
and I go cray cray because it's so much stuff. I told Doug yesterday he has he has had four generations of people in his family that mm -hmm. sell this fabric that he has in the back. There we go. <laughs> right. I wanted you to see. Made in Thailand, as you can see that, guys, right? But look. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, and mm. I mean, it is Benner Tech. And it's so, so it's, soft. Yeah. It's soft, but it's also firm. It, it's mm -hmm. not, you know, thin. Now, if you are watching, Jess. Yes. And I'm listening to you. I'm talking to y'all girls and guys. I can pick a couple more boats of these for our five, five o'clock show. It'd be a whole completely new thing. Oh, that could be mm -hmm. fun. Yeah. Yeah, maybe just five. Me just and keep you. it to yeah, a couple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Me and you go back there and grab the next ones, okay? And I understand brights, so I'm going to love that. All right? Well, th there's one I'm thinking of that uh, I know these ladies would probably jump at, and we'll discuss that one. Since we are in our prepping mode, right, let's go right into our green this is the one we're calling lime since I don't yep. have a sticker. Oh my word. Isn't that gorgeous? Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. If you buy ten yards, ladies, it's thirty nine dollars for ten yards of fabric. You can use it for backing. I mean that, that that's well I I know a number of people who love dots as their backing. Hey Barbara. You guys, you can send stars now too, by the way. But here's your look. This is your trendy. Thank y'all for sharing. Mm -hmm. Here's your trendy. Isn't that pretty? And since we are doing our, our preppy fun stuff, uh, I mean, this is very '80s vibe, and I'm oh, no, feeling oh, yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, I'm feeling it too, girlfriend. Let's do that navy and, and lime together because in, in pink, because this is going to be a hot. Look, I'm not going to say yeah. hot mess. It's going to be hot. And they are calling this one just navy. No yeah. na no white, no nothing, yeah. just because navy. Because the navy that's in here, which can be for, look, look, you can use this for clothing. I'm telling you guys, it's crazy. Yes. You could do a vest. A vest. I mean, that would be your classic of your classic dark blue shirts. Mm -hmm. Look at I that. Mean, look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? And this would be a great for a guy's shirt, a woman's shirt, or whatever. But that's what I mean. Mm -hmm. I, I could see that as a, a, a your guy's collared shirt. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And this bl this blue, it's it's like a it's like a faded. You see how it, it fades in? It's not light. It's well, it's a light blue, but it doesn't pop off like like a starchy Ooh, yes, classic, classic bows. bows. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Isn't that the coolest darnest thing? All right. And so there, so we have this. All right. Fabulous, fabulous, fabulous. And I know that somebody is going to do. The lime. Yes. Somebody came in and bought six yards of the paint. You know what she said? She's gonna do for she's gonna do that for baby quotes. Absolutely. Because it's perfect for baby quotes. And since I'm speaking of baby quotes, right? Mm hmm This will be great for a boys' baby quote. I did it with my nose. Mmm. And this is a very, very light blue. Well, it's not. No, a, I, would the, call I think that, that's this one. I think it's lavender. It's lavender, what calling but it. you know, it, it's a bluish it, it, lavender. It's it's very much on the blue side. So you can see, you can see how pretty that looks together. Yeah. And then, last but not least. It's a turquoise white, and I, I'm a turquoise freak. I mean, this is a very good turquoise. Mm -hmm. I like turquoise. And guys, think of this too. This would be wonderful for binding. I, you I'm could do binding. The backs of your nautical quilts. That's just. I mean, that speaks to me. Mm -hmm. It does have a little bit of a. Yeah, purple Barbara, undertone. it does have some purple in it, yeah. but it is very much more blue forward a lavender than purple that you're used to and you know what i would call this is really personally i would call that periwinkle i i agree entirely mm -hmm. but look at this turquoise that turquoise is talking to me mm -hmm. it's gorgeous mm -hmm. so so guys we still have those solids on special okay guys those i'm gonna tell you this no, some of you guys might be new we still have our 
boundless, not boneless, boundless <laughs> boutiques on special. And we have them here so that we can still cut them for you. But we have our blue, good high quality boundless. This is a two yard at $7.98. And anything beyond that would be $3.98 after you buy, you know, the third yard, fourth yard, fifth yard, sixth yard. Here's our fabulous pink. And we have gone and played with these side by side to Kona cotton, and there is almost no discernible difference between the two of them. Mm hmm. Yeah. I I'm liking Barbara's comment here. Mm -hmm. I wonder if we have any red back there. Yeah, we do. Ooh. Do you want a small dot? Ideas. Go, ideas. go ahead and grab. You, no, no, because we're coming back at five. We, no. We've got well, ideas. No, let's get, let's get a. You go, can you run back there and grab two reds? Yeah, hold on. I want. Here's blue, pinky, and banana. That's what I call that. We have solid white. Ladies, these are still on sale, okay? And black. Let's go back there real quick, Doug, and let's give them an opportunity if they want to buy these fabulous fabrics. And plus, they can. Y'all guys can talk. Oh, yes. We can talk have all quick. sorts I'll of fun. Right. Yeah, yeah it's that right. turquoise right there. Just, we're going to go grab a couple. Be because we love to squirrel. <laughs> all righty. What's that? I'm going to go grab a flyer. Hang on real quick, ladies. All right, so I am starting to look into some block of the month kits that I can bring into the store. This, these don't come until January, at least if I order them. But what are your thoughts? These are a, a batik. They're all banyans, and they're off the basics. This is their brighter colored one. And then they've got the same thing in a gray tone. Where's the, there's the picture. So I'm starting to explore if this is an option, but if you guys know of any others that you may be interested in to give me some ideas of, please let me know. Oh my second is definitely I got. What did he get? What did he get? I got. Oh, we're doomed. Doug we're is, doomed. Doug is coming back with more. Ready? Are we ready, Freddy? Freddy, Freddy, ready, ready? Oh, I got one that's going to be really cool. Barbara, I am looking at hoping for a, um, a an actual class with them, and hopefully we can figure this one to be a um, a Zoom class, a block what? of the month. Oh yeah, I'm getting some ideas on yeah, some got, of the things I've I gotten got, from vendors. I got to get somebody that can um, keep up with the zooming for me. Uh, I, I'm gonna figure it out. It's easy to do. It's just that you got to send an email out and all that stuff. Uh, Cindy, and, uh, the one that I showed you is um, Northcott's Banyan Boutiques, but. I'm looking at some of the others. Guys, this looks, it might come off with that warm light as a, um, 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 no, that, that's orange. Good old this red, is red. good red, primary red. I wanted to put it right next to the, to the navy so that you can see. And where's that white, white, that white? Up top. Okay. So here's your red, white, and blue quilt right there. Hello. Isn't that cool? All right. Wouldn't that be fun? All right, the turquoise, the turquoise. I need a turquoise, sir. I need a turquoise, sir. Is that the regular? Yeah. I need that, sir. All right, this one is turquoise yellow. Mm. Mm, wait until you see that one. All right, All right so, so they want bringing wanted, back the dark turquoise and white. Dark turquoise and white, and they wanted to see it up against what? Uh, what was it they wanted to see I it can't up see against? It. Oh, next to the red. Next so you to, got it in the screen. Next to the red. Oh, that is, uh, uh, that is, I'm trying to think what it is I'm thinking of, and it just, it screams my childhood, and I can't remember from what. The manufacturer of this is um, Benetex. The red and the turquoise. So. Benetex, okay. 
100% cotton. 45. I know what it is. It's thing one and thing two. <gasps> that is what it is, Chicky Poo. Hello. There's your costume. <laughs> All right. Good Good for this, ladies. Yep, we're getting the red. All right. Somebody's want to read it. Red. All right. Give me that. All right, well, we're going to put these. No, I can always show this again. Now, this is a, this is something that I just love. What is this called? This was, this one coming is the turquoise yellow. And it reminds me of really, it is, it is an aqua, really pretty turquoise, like a, a, a with a green hint to it. It's almost, I think the Kona color it's similar to, I think is Aloha. Isn't that pretty? And and I love the, the, the yellow. yellow. is so unexpected a choice, but I love it. It goes so well. And then we have this one, which I don't think I have a tag for you, girlfriend. Okay. But it's a, is that brown or is that it's a black? It's a, it's a brown. All right, so we're going to call this pink and brown. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to put that right there. So here's your brown. All right, pair it, pair it with... Oh, the, the turquoise yellow. That's a good idea. It, it, it's a perfect color. Is it? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's ridiculous. It was made for it. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Look at that. That'd be a beautiful baby quilt. And the only reason why this is like that is because we, should, we rip... Okay, okay, okay. We rip it. But isn't that pretty? So we're going to give you a chance to see if you want some of that. That was Barbara, right? Yes. Okay. And then... And then this pink brown. And it, you really have to look at it to see that it's brown. It... You could certainly play it as black if you wanted hold on, to. Hold on, hold Is on. Is it black? On. My bad. It's black. Is it black? Yeah, because the because of the little solid. Gotcha. They got the, they got. There is a garbage. there is a brown and pink one back there, but see that right there. Oh, sorry. So this is the black one. Yeah, that's black. So that's a black one. Okay. So pink and black. All right. Is that all we did, duck, duck, sir? I think that's everything we brought out today. Yes. For now. All right. These are going to go back to the back. They are going to go to the back, guys. If you want more, go to Fabric Hut. We, we, we shared it to you. Go to FabricHut.com. Yeah, we're going to post it again. We're going to post it again for you so that you can go right here in the messaging and go straight to our Fabric Hut. You can get yardage and yardage of, of the other colors. There are plenty of it. This morning, I did get online to show you how easy it is to shop for it. Yes. And each item is, each item is a, an actual item number. They're not, you know, that you don't have to, you know, you can actually say I'm looking for pink dots. Right. All right. Did you want this pink and black, Cindy? And Barbara would like to know how long is this sale going on for? On, at least through um, next Saturday. All right. So at least till Mother's Day. Mm -hmm. So we put it online this morning. Okay, so that you can shop online. Just remember, if you walk in the door, it's not going to be found. It is a warehouse product that we're introducing to you that is only sold normally for nine ninety five. So you got to get it now. Okay, so last call. Here is the pink and black. We're going to take that away, Ducky. All right, pass me the stack. Let me double check that I got everybody. Here is that that turquoise uh, olive. Uh, not olive. The um yellow yellow but it is a wonderful green so we're very gonna, minty mm, yep so we're gonna give you a last chance to get this because we are gonna put them away all right we also have that wonderful navy hello it is gorgeous got the dark turquoise mm -hmm. hands hands there we go there it focuses. We have Periwinkle. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's what I'm going to call that. Periwinkle. A hand in there. There we go. We have this fabulous 
Is this this is the medium pink. Mm-hmm. 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 I had no idea we had these fabrics. This is the white and pink. There we go. Wonderful. Mm-hmm. Okay. So that's it. Now, girlfriend, you're going to be doing your um, how to make sure everyone yeah, so double check their, their product. All right. So, Cindy, we have got the red. I'm getting there. The dark turquoise. The orange. The dark pink. And the lime. For Kathy, we've got the light green, white, almost seafoamy one. And a pack of white bread. And for Judy Canty, we've got the violet and white. And that's all. That's all I got for now, but, y you know, crazy will happen in another few hours. Okay. So, we still have 15 people? Yep. All right. I did this. I did this yesterday. You did do this yesterday. <laughs> yes, I did this for us yesterday. Here is two and three-fourths yards. Give y'all last chance to get that before I put it away. All right. This is two and three-fourths yards. It is $11.59. This is with tax. This is four four dollars seven dollars $7.41. That's that ombre. Just give me y'all option again before we put this for our blowout tomorrow. Giving you first dibs. Mm-hmm. Here's some... Here's a pre-cut white if you want to grab that. That is $7.98. It's already cut for you, ready to roll. I have one uh, and a two uh, of that. I have one yard of this fabulous color here. This is really cool. And this is this is with tax. One yard of fabric, six dollars and eighty six cents. Chameleons. Chameleons. Mm-hmm. And then here is two yards of fabric for four dollars and seventy-seven cents on my chickens. Right, Doug? All my yeah, chicken? All your chicken. Mm, all my chicken. Now, if you want some purple, hello. Here is purple dot. You want it back? See ya. Here is two yards for for six dollars and sixty-seven cents of the purple. I have two of those to sell right now. If you want them, I did not have this the other day. So fabulous, fabulous, fabulous. If you want those, that is the last chance for those. And I do have other fabrics on the bottom that I'm going to show tomorrow at our blowout. So we have those going on. But these are just these little last minute things if you want to grab them. Okay. Ready? We're good. I'm good. Okay. So I'm going to do this. Pop it over. All right, Chickapoo. Hello. Hola. I am back here. Hola. <laughs> Happy Cinco de Mayo, and may the fourth be with you. Kathy wants one of the purple ones. Oh, gotcha, girlfriend. Let's get you a purple, girl. There it is. Before I close out, anybody want anything else? Hello. Good squirrel. That is just pretty, pretty, pretty. Mm, my chicken. Oh, my God. Look, look, look. That's hers? That's her. That's hers, hers. That's hers, the, hers? The, no, no. Hers is these two. Oh, Kathy, look at that. I like this match. Isn't that pretty? Look at that, Kathy. Mm. Mm. All right, and that's something. Hey, who did this? That's uh, Judy. Judy, before you go, this is two yards for six dollars and sixty seven cents. Look how that, look how that goes with that. Isn't that nice? You want that, Judy? And by the way, Terry, if Terry's watching, Terry, we have the bag left over from last week. It's still back there, and that is going to be shipped with the other bag. Oh, did they, the bag get missed? Yeah, they got missed. They thought that we were waiting. Uh, somebody put my name on it and said, hold it. Gotcha. Yeah. So, so um, that's going to be shipped out. And then somebody left a bag last week that and didn't call us. So, I hope they would call us because we're going to put that back in. I want to put it back in the... In the pile. In the pile tomorrow. So, if you don't claim it, I can't remember who it is. Oh, Judy wants the purple and the rainbow geckos. Okay, so this is going to be you, girlfriend, there. And look, look at that rainbow gecko. Oh, my God. We have this by the yard, too, by the way. Yeah, I, I, I have to admit, I have contemplated them too. for a long time. There's, we have, different backgrounds. there's three backgrounds. 
but I think the white is the best of them. I love it because it's so bright. I'm going to make some shorts out of that. Those would make some really cool shorts. Mm, right, 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 for my parties. All right. So, guys, we're going to we're gonna clear off again. We'll see you at 5 o'clock. Um, I was definitely um, um, doofy <laughs> yesterday when I did my video. Said I said five, uh, happy hours at 2. I have no clue where I got that from. That, that's what you get when I'm down with a cold. I know. And guess what? <laughs> You know, Doug won't be here because you know what he has to do? Mm. <laughs> He'll get a haircut. He's going to finally get his hair done. Mm -hmm. I, I think that's a worthy reason to. Uh, mm -hmm. well, look to at, this, look at this hot mess. Mary Beth, uh, yep, oh. that, that, okay. Yeah, Mary Beth, please let us know because that, that is, um, we can't hold it. So, are you able to call to charge it because we've been, it's been cut? And it's been, yeah, uh, and just give us gotta, a call afterwards, and whenever you make to pick it up, yeah, after it's we been just paid gotta, for. we got to get yeah. everything that we are, we're doing, guys, um, because it is going to be five o'clock in a few, in not 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 far from here. You can wait until five, but at the end of the day, you got to make your purchases. So we yes. don't want to tag this on to tomorrow, okay, guys? But thank you so much. Fabric mm -hmm. Hut, we're friends with Fabric Meat. Yes. Yes, and the number is seven five seven five eight eight. 1300. Option one. Option one. Thank you guys. Okay. Don't forget a gift card sale. Yep. Bye.